The Detroit Lions held a meeting with free agent defensive lineman Ricky Jean Francois. So this is kind of an interesting one, and obviously I don't know if the Detroit Lions are actually going to sign RJF or not, or if they're just going to leave him as a free agent, but they decided to bring him in for a meeting with Ricky Jean Francois, and he may have a possible return. It's actually been getting more and more like Elvin the last few hours that, okay, maybe this guy will be coming back to the Detroit Lions. And that's kind of interesting for me, because this is a guy that I talked about um, a few videos ago, probably about a week ago, and I said that, hey, this is a free agent the Detroit Lions should actually look at signing, and that's Ricky Jean Francois. We had a few guys that were kind of on the injury type of list that when they came out from the defensive line. We some young guys like PJ Johnson, we had Austin Bryant, some guys like that. And some of them aren't very serious, but it was still like, okay, the Detroit Lions have a roster spot open. Maybe they'll go get a guy like this, like Ricky John Francois, who's familiar with the Detroit Lions system. He was with them in 2018. It would kind of make sense to bring this guy in. He's a veteran type of player. He's going to add some depth to the team. So it'd be a nice move to bring this guy back to the squad. And now they're talking about, okay, now they're meeting with this guy and he may be possibly back on the team for 2019. And I wouldn't be surprised at all if he's back on the team for 2019. Now, with that being said, we have some other big news like with Trey Flowers, you know, we've heard about the bad news that he's, you know, maybe not serious, maybe they're just trying to take caution him on the injured list, but I think everything will be fine there. But as we know, you still want to have depth and right before training camp starts, like this is very close to the to right before training camp starts, they decided to meet with Ricky Jean Francois. And I would love to see this man make a return with the Detroit Lions. He did good things when he was with the Lions. He's bounced around all over the league and he's done good things everywhere he's been. He's a good veteran, he's shown a lot of leadership, and he would be really nice to a lot of those young guys. And at the same time, if we have guys that are out due to injuries it would really nice to, it would be really nice to have some depth and obviously you have to have a lot of depth throughout training camp but this is one of those guys that probably wouldn't just be on the team for a certain stint like he actually could make the team and he could play a role in 2019 and we know how important it is for Matt Patricia to have depth on the defensive line he wants to have guys fresh he wants to have guys moving in and out and that's something that Ricky John Francois can bring to Detroit Lions and I think that would make a lot of sense for them to bring this guy in like I said they're meeting with him and I just thought that was kind of interesting because I kind of talked about that before and now they're saying okay now we're going to meet with this guy so I think it'd be really cool if RJF was with the Detroit Lions for 2019 obviously by the time this video coming out something could have changed and the Detroit Lions could have signed this guy that could definitely happen we'll have to wait and see what happens because you know the thing with sports talk is like I can't necessarily set put a video out for a certain time um, sometimes when it's updates because updates change and if I get an update that says okay Detroit Lions aren't gonna sign him then this video doesn't make any sense. And if I get an update that says they signed him, it's like, oh, that's cool. But you already said he was working out camp. Like, you haven't said that yet. And you already had this video come out. They already signed him. You know, so everything is kind of messed up. That's why sometimes you'll get a day of tons of videos. And other days, you'll be kind of slow where you get, like, one or two videos. Some days will get, like, four. Because it's like, dang, big news is going on. So with that being said, um, anyways, I would like to see RJF back with Detroit Lions. Let me hear your thoughts in the comments below. If this video is coming in late, I apologize. But I just want to make sure this comes out before any other breaking news happens with Detroit Lions. Thank you, Pratt, for watching. And I'm out.